Hi, and welcome to the fifth episode of Canyon Side Chat. That is our weekly video production from the State Senate um, Democratic Caucus. This is where we tell you what's going on at your State Senate. Today, I am joined by our Democratic Whip, Senator Lisa Otondo from District 4. Lisa, it's a pretty big district you're, you're representing. My district is the second largest district, so it encompasses Goodyear, Buckeye, Gila Bend, half of Yuma County, uh, Ajo, a piece of Tucson, and both the Cocopa and Tohono O'odham Nations. So wow. it's really, really quite big. It certainly is. So let's talk about your bills. I understand you've got two that are moving. So tell me about the first one, Senate Bill 1476. It passed out of the Senate on Wednesday. And congratulations on that. Thank you, thank you. Good. So 1476 is an internship bill. It's internship for agriculture. It's for $275,000. Um, now this money is going to be um, given in grant form to organizations, NGOs, businesses for agricultural interns. And I'd like to explain why this was brought to me. This was brought to me actually by one of my constituents in Ajo. Many of you already know that there are food deserts all over Arizona. And there's a food desert, a couple of food deserts in my district. Mm -hmm. The closest grocery store in Ajo is 75 miles away, and the food bank was closed. So this is actually monies that can be used for interns to help produce farms on a small farm that's in Ajo to help feed the locals. They're doing sustainable farming out there. And it can also be used as the um, by businesses as well. But it's based on a need basis. So it's great. You know, I really want to help our food deserts. Um, and, and help those communities that are really desperate, uh, in desperate need of fresh produce. Also, as you well know, um, diabetes is a huge concern, um, especially on the sovereign nations, but really all over the state. So this is helping in a lot of different ways. So I'm really excited about this bill. It's a small appropriation, but an important one. But this bill now goes over to the state house where it goes through the committee process, is that correct? That's right, so it'll be assigned over there. I don't know which committees will be hearing it, but like always, follow the bill, follow my bill, continued support. And I really wanna thank the agricultural community of Arizona who has gotten behind my bill and given it support. It's really important. Now as is agriculture in the state of Arizona. So. That's true. Agriculture is critical here. Your other bill is uh, doing well as uh, as as to um, in addition, and that is Senate Bill 1477. What would that bill do? So that's the best land management practices bill. Uh, so, yes. you know, Senator, as you all know, um, I've been very involved in the water issues in Arizona. But uh, when you talk about water, you also have to talk about forest health watersheds and municipalities infrastructure. So what this bill does is it helps tribal, federal, and state lands move, remove hazardous vegetation. We've seen what happened in California. Right. The devastating fires, loss of life, yes. loss of property. Um, so what this bill will do will uh, bring four million um, that can be, as I said, used on tribal, federal, and state lands to help mm -hmm. remove hazardous um, hazardous vegetation. There are other groups that are doing things, but it's time that the state also put forth money and worked in collaboration with these other groups. We've had devastating fires here. As a matter of fact, one of the huge fires, and many people don't know this, but it damaged the water infrastructure in Scottsdale. This has huge ramifications mm -hmm. for water infrastructures throughout the state, and one of the things that we're trying to fight is loss of water, um, what we call system loss and system loss is loss of water throughout uh, infrastructure systems. So this is a, a proactive measure um, to join and collaborate with other groups so that we can promote forest health, <laughs> save our watersheds, and also help to protect the municipality's infrastructure. And by the way, just as an aside, um, <clears throat> the devastating fires in California have also led to a need for building materials. Mm -hmm. Now with some of the vegetation removal, these, these uh, removals, the, what's being removed from the forest can also be used into particle board. Now we're not talking 
old trees are, you know, we're not mm -hmm. going, going in and devastating our forest. That is not it. But particle board. Right now, some of the removal is being used um, for pallets, yeah. but there is a market. So there's also potential That's for wonderful. wood products um, for uh uh, for businesses here this as well. This is a critical bill. This is just an amazing bill. Thank you so much for bringing that. You know, I've got to tell you something. For five yeah. years I've been working on this, and I re I'm really thankful because it was voted unanimously out of both chambers here, wow. a 9 zero vote in appropriations. And this is really unprecedented for a lot of Democrats who haven't had bills heard in forever. I've been here for six years. Right. And you know, what we found is that many of us just handed off our bills to our Republican colleagues to run for us. So I'm mm -hmm. very thankful that our bills are being heard yes. and our bills are moving. So I'm so glad. And you yeah. make us proud, Lisa. Okay, so Senator, if, um, if people want to help, how can they help? Uh, like always, uh, these bills will be moving to the House. So Speaker Bowers will be the one with the power to actually have the bills heard in committee or and to move the bills. So it will always be the Speaker of the House. Please contact Speaker Rusty Bowers through email. <laughs> rbowers at azleg.gov. All right. And if you would like to do that, please click on the link that is below and it'll tell you how to contact the Speaker of the House to help push Senate Bills 1476 and 1477 through. So, Senator Otondo, thank you so much for thank joining you so us much. on Canyon really Side nice. Chat today. This Loved was it. fun. And thank, thank you. you for joining Canyon Side Chat, and we'll be back next week with another episode. Thank you. Thank you.